Do you have the upcoming interview and you start watching lot of mock interviews? In YouTube, you have hundreds of YouTube videos related to the mock interviews. Still, you are not able to crack the interview, right? What is happening? In this video, I'm going to talk about what are the five reasons why the Q8 or tech interviews that you see generally most of the online or prep content it's actually ineffective and instead what you need to do that i'm going to talk about a uh, live demos proper examples with the case study also what are the things that you need to do instead of watching the mock interviews i know okay promote sir i have prepared all the content i am basically done with my java selenium and everything i want to apply for automation role i want to apply for manual testing role right now i start watching mock interviews i get discouraged because there are a lot of other questions which people are asking no that is not a correct approach so what you need to do five important points we are going to discuss very simple video from the end watch till the end i'm going to give you live examples real life things that you can showcase projects that you need to showcase which resume how exactly you need to do that what are the things that you need should know to crack the interview this is what we are going to do so okay let's get started number 1 misalignment with the job requirement guys the moment you watch the videos of the mock interviews i'm pretty much sure that this is the problem that you must found which is interviewer is basically focusing more on theoretical issues theoretical problems and everything they don't discuss about the real things which is happening right now in the company what are the practical project that you have done so candidates basically what they do is generally they start often by basically telling about tell me about yourself and everything but what are the practically they have done this is the most important thing you need to understand what do you mean pramod let me tell you. i have given multiple interviews the interviews where i have discussed about my practical projects how i have done it i have showcased it so this is one of the example also by the way if i show you also this is one of the demo which i wanted to show you also let me open this the moment i showcase the practical things everyone so if you open the sd.life/project1 the moment you showcase your practical projects the number of chances will definitely get high. you don't have to be like okay watching hundreds of mock interviews instead of this you need to do which is you need to showcase if you have prepared any test plan you need to showcase create a generic template create a free template create remove all the things which are related to the credentials which are uh, what we call related to companies make it generic showcase what is which is important this is the rule number 1 which we we have figured it out instead of watching hundreds of videos and everything we discuss about the full cycle of api i have given you example of api testing full example of api where what we have developed as a test plan test cases requirement test cases how you have automated by using postman how we have automated by using the rest assured discuss everything for example in the github repository also how you have automated the full scenario as an automation this is what which is working right now this is what we have seen so instead of watching the videos and everything focus more on showcasing the real things second important point why interviews mock interviews are ineffective is most of the time you will see they will basically tell you to use whiteboard brain teasers they will give you puzzles and everything right which is again not effective these methods are 29% less effective as compared to the real world scenario that's why i told you also right you need to showcase your experience of if you have created the automation framework which is much 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 more greater than rather than showcasing or telling about okay i have worked with this project rather than so manual testers what you can showcase you can showcase your test plans you can showcase your test cases you can showcase if you have used the requirement documentation you can showcase that you can showcase if you have used use the data driven testing by using postman report generations and everything as an automation tester if you have some experience you can showcase your repositories like i have doing it for example my github profile if you see right you can showcase your github profile also that okay yes this person has coded this person has created repository that is the real thing so real things are always greater than the theoretical puzzles and everything which basically people are asking okay third important point which is lack of standardization and consistency which means if you are continuously watching the mock interviews and everything guys the important thing is all about the consistent preparation rather than watching hundreds of mock interviews i remember there was a girl named amita she said promote sir i have watched like 100 plus videos of mock interviews still i was not sure and everything i said no you don't have to watch hundreds of videos instead you have to be consistent in your learning and your make your learning as in your interview which means you need to prepare your interviewer side by side what exactly i am saying i am saying this which is i have basically if you know we are running automation tester blueprint batch this is 11x batch where what we do is side by side preparation of your java 
java cyber side preparation of your selenium cyber side which is a learning of your api you need to do all the challenges like left pattern triangle palindrome pattern array strings and everything directly consistently you need to do it you can follow the tracker also where daily you are doing all the things and that's how you get more results rather than watching hundreds of mock interviews and everything in the end fourth important point which basically means anxiety and stress i have seen people watching mock interviews they said okay promoter we don't know about these questions they prepare only those questions but instead interviewer ask a different question so it basically creates anxiety and stress don't think about it what you need to do is you need to your preparation is much 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 greater than the mock interviews that you are doing guys please remember java selenium and api all the topics and everything i have already given you in this you just need to prepare for this preparation is much much greater than the, the mock interviews which are important definitely you need to watch mock interviews but watch it till in the end very minimum preparation is something consistency is something showcasing is important all these are very very important right last one which is create a performance based illusion what do you mean which means developing a skill which means adding a ci cd adding an automation adding a ai knowledge is much much greater than the mock interviews that you are saying guys i know a person who was a manual tester he added api testing and now he is working as an api tester the, i am the real you can say person who basically started learning selenium i was able to crack based on my learning rather than watching interviews and everything i have not paid that much attention to that so overall in the conclusion what i want to say your projects are more important showcasing is more important your mock interview is very less as compared to the real scenarios that you are basically saying rejection due to hacker rank challenges and everything we have seen it it's common but again your preparation should not get hampered i have seen people getting rejected because they don't know how to use hacker rank and everything but definitely you should recommend and do it but my question my philosophy where other people where like like hundreds of people who are getting result who are moving from manual to automation by using this you can see the testimonials also this is the same strategy they are doing showcasing your project which is important showcasing your live projects uploading them into github repositories doing preparation which more than which is always greater than the mock interview thanks for watching i hope this helps what do you, you think ki that preparation is important rather than mock interview or not let me know your thoughts all the links which i am going to discuss about uh, the questions and everything i will share it just type resources in the chat and like a video i'll share you thanks for watching i'll see you in the next video bye bye